What's up YouTube, Silver Dragons here, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to get the best price possible when you're buying gold backs. So let's do it. Thank you so much for watching my video. I do sincerely appreciate it. I'm gonna show you a few tricks in this video that hardly anyone knows about. All right, so you can call these tricks, you can call these hacks, you can call them whatever you want, but this is a way to obtain gold backs at the lowest price humanly possible so let's go over to the computer and i'll show you how to do it all right so the first step is to go over to goldback.com and as you can see this is the average exchange rate right here three dollars and 76 cents for one gold back so that's basically what one gold back is worth right now if you wanted to go out and spend it now we're going to be able to buy them well under this price uh so don't worry i'm going to show you the tricks here uh, but if you don't know what a gold back is it says right here the gold back is the world's first physical interchangeable gold money that is designed to accommodate even small transactions learn how to purchase gold back with this guide all right so we're going to go to the guide to getting gold backs here and this is a list of all of the websites that sells gold backs so you can go to every single one of these and find the best price that's actually the first step is to shop around uh, we can see the one utah gold back here at max five dollars and 77 cents uh, we're not going to pay that let's go over to hero bullion uh 427 for the one utah okay we're getting better uh and one of the best that i found was actually jm bullion check this out for the one utah 373 so that's actually below the exchange rate right there uh, but we can get them cheaper so there's a trick that not a lot of people know about and that is you can buy whatever denomination gold backs you want and then you can exchange them for a different denomination and i will show you how to do that momentarily but first let me kind of explain what i'm talking about here so we go over to sd bullion here and check out the price for the one gold back uh five dollars and 13 cents now as we know that's way over the exchange rate you don't want to pay that but let's say you want to get one gold backs all right let's say that's what you're after you can buy any denomination you can get the fives you can get the tens the 25s the 50s and you can exchange them for ones so the cheapest price is actually going to be the 50 and uh, we can do the math here so it's 160 bucks basically uh, so let's divide that by 50 so 159.64 divided by 50 so we got three dollars and 19 cents for one gold back that's per gold back that's what you're going to pay and that's well below the exchange rate so now the question is how do i take these 50s and actually exchange them for ones and how much is that going to cost me now you might be after the 50 this might be what you actually want but if you want to be able to break it down into smaller denominations here's how you do that so we go over to alpine gold exchange right it's just alpinegold.com so basically this is a bank account more or less you can mail them your physical gold backs they will vault them for free so they can hold them for you if you like um let's say there's a state that hasn't come out yet like we know wyoming is going to be coming out pretty soon let's say you want to get the wyoming gold backs you can send in your gold backs right now they will hold them for you for free and then when the wyoming comes you can request those um in whatever denomination you want like the ones the fives etc uh so how you do this is you just sign up for an account so we go over to sign up um i don't have account you're gonna fill in all your information and then basically you're gonna have an account at that point now here's the part where it talks about the guarantee right so the gold back guarantee alpine gold guarantees that any gold back purchased vaulted or transferred may be exchanged for any other quantity of gold backs of the same face value for example a 50 denomination may be exchanged for 50 of the one denomination of any available state series so you send in the 50 utah you get 50 of the ones in new hampshire however you want to do it and uh, shipping charges may apply so we're going to talk about the shipping charges uh, because this isn't free i mean obviously they got to pay to ship them back to you you got to pay to ship them to them and then uh, they do offer a zero percent buy sell spread for up to ten thousand a month that's if you're selling your gold back so if you buy gold backs from them you want to sell them back to them 
uh, then they're going to do that at literally 0% buy sell spread. Now, we're not trying to sell them anything. We're trying to exchange, which they will do for free. You just pay shipping. So here's how you do it. We go over to how to order gold backs. This is going to be the steps right here. So step one, fund your gold back account. These accounts do not have any membership or vaulting fees. So you're literally going to set up your account like I showed you and then mail them your physical gold backs. Step two, send an email to them requesting delivery of your account holdings uh, and then tell them exactly what you want, you know, what denomination, what state, whatever. They will email you back, say no problem. And then down below is where it actually shows the fees for shipping. So right here. Uh, as an example, if you order 100 gold backs face value with an exchange rate of 330, your total shipping cost would be approximately 1160. Using the same exchange rate, if you order 500 gold backs face value, your total shipping cost would be approximately 2290. So let's say that's what you do. Let's say you buy 10 of the 50s, you mail them in to your vaulted account, and then the next day or whenever they get them, you say, okay, I want 500 of the ones. This is what they're gonna charge you to ship them back. So let's say this is what you have to pay to ship them there, okay? You ship them priority and uh, you get the insurance and all that stuff. So let's see how much extra this is gonna cost per gold back. So it's $45.80. I already did the math here, as you can see, uh, to ship them there and have them shipped back. So we're gonna divide that by 500 gold backs. And it's going to cost you about nine cents per gold back to ship your 50s there and get your ones shipped back. So now let's go over to SD Bullion again and figure out the total price you're going to pay for ones. You're not paying this 513. So if we do the math here, again, we got 159.63 divided by 50. So it's 319. We're going to add nine cents that's going to bring it to three dollars and 28 cents per gold back that's the total price you're going to pay for the ones of any state that is way cheaper than you can buy them anywhere else now real quick i don't know if you guys realize but i just showed you how to basically create your own infinite money machine so i don't know if this is going to work forever but if you can exchange those gold backs for ones and then sell them on ebay people are getting pretty good premiums here five dollars uh 645 uh sometimes they even do better than that here's uh let's see 549 plus shipping <laughs> so there you go uh, we got 504. Uh, so you're getting five bucks. Here's 10 bucks for one gold back there. 10 bucks. And you got it for, again, 328. Uh, six bucks for that one. So as you can see, if you buy these and then resell them, you actually can make a pretty good amount of money on them. So I'm not saying that's what you should do, but you could do that right now. So there you have it. That is how you can get goldbacks at the cheapest price possible. Now, if you haven't seen my video on goldbacks in general, what they are, why you should be buying them, all that kind of stuff, definitely go check it out. I'll put a link up in the corner as well as a link down below in the description of this video. Now, the last thing I want to say about purchasing gold backs is that I know there's going to be people leaving comments down below saying, what a premium. My goodness, you're still paying a lot over spot when you buy these, even if you get them for 328 or whatever. And to that, I would say, yes, these do have a higher premium than gold that is intended for stacking, but these have a different purpose the purpose of the gold backs isn't to buy them throw them in your safe and then forget about them forever i mean you could do that and we've actually seen the price of gold backs go up significantly over the last year uh, but that's a topic for another video the gold backs purpose is a currency you're supposed to actually spend these so if you can buy them below the exchange rate and then go out and spend them for more then you're actually crushing it with these the purpose is to be able to use sound money as opposed to using fiat to make transactions. So there really is no other product like this out there on the market. And uh, I hope that this video was able to help you figure out how to get them cheaper because I don't want anyone paying really high premiums when you could get these for much less. So if you enjoyed the video, definitely make sure to smash that thumbs up, especially if you learned anything. And I do want to say a huge thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all in my next one. Silver Dragons, out.